Anyone who uses our airports knows how tight the security can be because of the threat of terrorism. But one thing you might not be aware of, the police are being helped by large groups of people armed with binoculars and radio scanners. Our transport correspondent, Keith Wilkinson, now explains more. On patrol around the security fence at Birmingham Airport, PC Ian Druitt on the lookout for anything suspicious. It's a huge area, but helping him, an army of people like Gordon Stretch. Viewpoint plus one, QNH, one zero zero five, runway damp, damp, damp. All members of the Birmingham Aviation Enthusiast Group. They come here for their hobby, to watch the planes land and take off. But because they are watching, they're also useful to the airport police. They've been given ID passes and have formed their own airport security scheme. Obviously, there are extra eyes in here, so it's everywhere because we can't be around all the airports and the, and the whole of the site all the time. They're here most of the day, so they notice that things are unusual, different. They all talk to each other, so they know each other. So if there's anyone there who's reporting to be a spotter or one of the huge ass who isn't, they'll be able to pick them out straight away. I've seen uh, you know, odd things around the airport that seem out of place because effectively uh, we're an airport watch and if we see things out of place I give Ian a call or I see, I see him around the car park or his colleagues. Many airports including Coventry have now got similar security schemes. Up to 200 can come in here on a good day or with their scanners and binoculars so if anything happens out there there's a good chance one of these will spot it first. Our members will come out any time when there's anything interesting, so we're here in the middle of the night as well as the middle of the day. Hopefully those people who've got mobiles can be uh, very useful and passing message on to the police. It's been nice the last few days. It's an unlikely alliance, but it's one that works. Keith Wilkinson at Birmingham International Airport for Central tonight.